What's up YouTube? So this is my 04 Wrangler. Um, so recently someone said that the body had rot on it. So let's just, let's get into it. No rot. I'll, and I'll take my time. No rot. No rot. No rot. That's bird shit. No rot. 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 If you're expecting to buy an 04 Wrangler that doesn't have any rust or surface rust or corrosion, you're out of your mind, especially in South Jersey. So a little paint work on the hinge, but that's not rot. That's a little rust. No rot. No rot. This was broke. I preserved it. No rot. No rot. No rot. No rot. Brand new top. Brand new wheels and tires. Brand new. Rear drum, shoes, hardware, all that's perfectly fine and done. Stainless steel brake hose, cross drilled and slotted rotors, all brand new. What else? No rot. <coughs> Some surface rot up here, or surface rust. Still solid. Upgraded uh, track bar, springs, control arms, adjustable. All right. So up here, it's not rusted out. This is the repair panels, uh, which is a bracket that goes over this. That's been welded in and also urethane sealed. So welded in and urethane sealed all over. So that's why you see the smeary stuff, urethane. This had a repair here uh, before I got it. This is urethane, urethane, urethane. All right. Uh, brand new bolts in the skid plate. I mean, a little teeny tiny bit here. Not bad at all. And then back here, I actually filled the frame rails with foam and then urethaned over in certain spots. So that's not bubbly rust. That's your thing over top of what I tried to preserve. All right, so no rust, no rust. In the back here, you can see that the bumper support back here, it's got a little blistering, minor. This is the, uh, the foam I sprayed inside the frame rail uh, to help preserve it. We don't take this off-road. I'm probably the third owner. New tail lights. Again, the, foam, the frame was filled with foam, okay? And then urethane over in multiple spots. Urethane, foam in the hole to keep moisture and dirt from getting inside. We don't take this off-road, never have. Urethane over the brackets. These are welded in repair plates. They sandwich over the frame well. That's urethane sealed front and back and welded in all the way up. <sighs> Upgraded control arms. So the frame is solid on this. It, is it brand new? No. Well, you're buying an 04. What do you expect? You want a solid frame vehicle? I got an 08 here with 230,000 miles on it. That's in better shape than most newer Jeeps today. Engine's quiet on cold start. Cross grill and solid rotors. Brand new battery. Air conditioning works. Stick works. Fuel pump was done a few years ago. Clutch was done a few years ago. 10 inch touch screen. Custom stereo, all kinds of speakers, amplifiers, four-wheel drive works, heat and air works. Everything works on this car. Well, upgraded headlights, uh, sub box. Take the sub box out, put this, put the uh, back seat back in. Uh, is it mint condition? No, but for an 04, it's in mint condition. The the lights work up here. I didn't wire them. Brand new fog lights, they work. Upgraded headlights, they work. Uh, the oil pan's got some surface rust on it. Uh, it's also got teeny, teeny, tiny seepages uh, from underneath. Minor. The transmission's poly, transmission mouth polyurethane, brand new. Muffler and tail, brand new. Upgraded motor mounts. Radiator has no leaks. 
This is a solid vehicle for $10,000. And what are the wheels and tires worth alone? Eight, sixteen, two thousand dollars in wheels and tires, four thousand just in the stereo system, not including the rest of the stuff on this Jeep. Beautiful. Two thousand eight Wrangler, brand new transmission from Precision Trans, brand new wheels and tires, cross drilled and slotted rotors all the way around. A uh, hard top from a 2010 or 11. Uh, no rust, no holes, no rot. The, the uh, gas tank skip plate definitely shows its signs. Axle seals do not leak. Park and brake works. Rancho 9000s adjustables. Brand new. Correction track bar bracket in the back. 9000 Ranchos in the front. New coil springs in the front. New pads and rotors in the front. Upgraded heavy duty track bar. Brand new radiator. Coil, coil, wires, plugs done. Rancho stabilizer, oil changed on every 3,000 miles. Axle seals do not leak front or rear, no wheel bearings. Brand new rebuilt transmission. Engine is quiet. I have this for 14,000. Has remote start. Engine doesn't make any noise. Uh, the stereo system cost me $4,000 with the remote start. Custom interior Upgraded lighting inside. Same thing with the red Jeep. Upgraded interior uh, interior lighting. This is an automatic four-wheel drive. Seats are in great condition. You're not going to find a better 08 Wrangler out there with 230,000 miles on it that runs and rides like brand new. Brand new wheels and tires. There's no rotted out frame on this thing. Nowhere. You look at Jeeps like this, and I look at them all the time. Axle seals are pissing, hub bearings are shot, brakes are fucked up, pissing oil, check engine light, oh, custom stainless steel muffler with dual outlets, trailer hitch, uh, what else is done on this thing? Catalytic converters were replaced, O2 sensors were replaced, um, this truck is a deal compared to what's out there today. Upgraded headlights, upgraded Angry Birds grill. This thing is a, a deal. Come check them out. Uh, I'm not going to open the interior on the on the, the two door, but the interior is basically mint. Premium seat covers. Uh, this is a Sahara edition. Dashboard's in great shape. Custom speakers. It's got two up top. Two, I think two in the uh, original positions. Upgraded sub. Two twelves. Sound bars upgraded with uh, six by nines, uh, LEDs to make the inside lights better. Tons and tons and tons of little things here to add up on this thing. Great condition. Either one of these vehicles are in great condition. Uh, but yeah, this is just a YouTube video to silence all the keyboard warriors out there. The frame's got too much rust. The body's got too much rust. Where's the rust on the body? Where's the rust on the frame on a 04? I look at brand new vehicles with 30,000 miles on it that have surface rust and rot and corrosion going on. So uh, you're not buying a brand new 04. You're not buying a brand new 08 or an 010 or a 12. Keep in mind, most of these things are beat to shit when you get to them because what do people do? They go and swamp them, four wheel drive. Never been swamped, never been swamped. Uh, I bought this from the previous owner whose father owned it before him. Uh, this, I bought this from a regular customer who, who had it for many, many years. Um, both great vehicles. So, I mean, you can't argue with new. New tires, new wheels, new lug nuts, new wheel spacers, new brakes, newer clutch, newer fuel pump, newer brake lines, stainless steel hoses in the front, new muffler. I mean, you're not finding these vehicles with all the new on it out there. Brand new hinges on the back of here for the common rattle issues. I have the original tires. I don't have the original tires for this. Uh, and like I said, this is off a newer model. The rear wiper blade's not wi wired. But, I mean, you're not buying junk. Premium, premium, high quality stereo, remote start. Both of these things are in great shape. You wanna look closer at this one. I mean, for 230,000 miles worth of driving and been maintained. 
<clears throat> rims aren't curved, tires aren't beat, springs aren't trashed, front end's got brand new upper arms, brand new lower arms with correction brackets, uh, front diff doesn't leak, axle seals don't leak, uh, I mean, it's showing a little bit here and there, we put the hinge covers on because it's showing a little bit there, a uh, little bit of paint chip here, minor stuff, <clears throat> I mean, if you want to get a color change and freshen up, make a deal for a thousand bucks, there's no body work on this frame solid it's got rock lights underneath of it custom stainless steel dual outlet muffler that's quiet uh pucks in the back sway bar links front and rear i mean this is no piece of shit and there's plenty of them out there i mean same thing with this no axle seal leaks no this no not no stabilizers blown out sway bar links are good radiators good heat and air work great vehicles both of them just nobody drives them. My son's got a Tesla. He's got a truck. I got this just to have a little bit of a project. This has like 136 on it. I know that has 230 on it. I mean, look at the steering wheel. This is a great, great, great vehicle. I actually love driving it. It handles amazing. Uh, and so what is that? I mean, anything with 35s on it is a little odd if you're not a Jeep guy, but... This is in great shape. Backup camera. Bumpers are not rotted out. Not on this one. This one's plastic. Legit. How much more do you really want to see? Brake lines aren't rotted out. This thing's in good shape. Really good shape. Like I said, this was broken when I got it I repaired it just to preserve it and you can see it's solid thanks for watching